Hi, I'm Kim, and today I'm going to share a quick tip to make your life easier if you use both IXL and Google Classroom. Did you know that you can easily create assignments for IXL right within Google Classroom? It's easy and it only takes a few steps. Let me share my screen and then we'll get started. Thanks. The easiest thing to do is make sure that you are logged into both Google Classroom and IXL. Then there are two ways that you can do assignments and I'll show you both of them. The first way is to just come in and look at your grade level skills and choose whatever module you would like them to do. So I'm just going to pick this one. So you're going to click and open it and then over here you're going to see share skill and you can share it with a link or you can share it to Google Classroom. So if I pick this Google Classroom link, it will come to this pop-up menu and you can choose the class that you want to share it to. And it gives you the ability to choose what you would like to do with it. So I'm going to say create assignment, say go. And then here you just have to put in whatever directions you would want to put. And you can add in a point value, your due date, you can put it into a topic if you have them. So I might say classwork, um, and then you're going to say assign. And then it will ask if you want to view it so you can see what it looks like in your Google Classroom also. So I'm going to come into classwork and down here you can see the IXL assignment was posted right here. And when your students click on it, it will bring them right to the assignment that you want them to do. So that's the first way to do it. I'm going to go back to the original screen where I was and I'm going to go back into all of the fifth grade skills and I'm going to choose a coordinate plane for this one. So I'll say I want them to do this. I'm going to hover over share skill again, but this time I'm going to choose a link. So it will copy the link for you. Click into your Google Classroom. Choose Create Assignment. You'll do Add Link and post that link right there. And that will bring your students directly to the activity within IXL that you want them to do. Now, you might think it's easier to just create the assignment like we did the first time. But I like to use the link if I already have a math assignment planned and I want to add in the IXL as additional practice for them to do. So I like to use the link. It really is up to you how you want to do it, but I love how easy it is. So again, once you put the link in, you'll have to put your title. any directions that you would want to give them. You can choose your topic. If you use topics, you can decide whether you want all of your students or just some of your students to do it and whether you want to have a point value or not. And I'm just going to hit assign. And then if I scroll down to classwork, there's my coordinate grid practice. And by clicking on it, your students will be taken right to the question that you want them to do. Easy way to integrate IXL and Google Classroom, particularly right now with distance learning. It's making it a lot easier for me to make sure that my students are doing the practice that I want them to do. Thanks for listening.